So we're here with Jimmy Tibbs, just had the press conference with Billy Joe Saunders and Chris Eubank Jr. And uh, Chris Eubank Jr. actually uh, turned up today. Were you surprised by that? I'll be honest with you, I was very surprised. But, uh, it, was, uh, it, was, it was good he showed up but on his own. Very good, yeah. That's another thing you mentioned, he was on his own. I mean, you were surprised that he turned up. Were you even more surprised that he was by himself? Well, yeah, to be honest with you, I was, yeah, yeah. And, I mean, in, in that press conference, um, you've come back from uh, Marbella now at the MGM. How have preparations been going ahead of this fight? And, I mean, have you been um, looking at this has Billy's toughest fight to date so far? Well, this is going to be a tough fight. We're, we're, we'll put it this way, we're prepared for a tough fight. Right? Whether it's going to be his toughest fight, we'll see that on the night. Because this guy hasn't fought the people that Billy Joe's fought. And uh, he's not even done a 10 rounder. But we're not underestimating him. That's why we went away to train. And uh, we're ready for anything on the night. And, I mean, Billy, of course, holds a number of titles, um, been in championship matches, whereas Chris Eubank hasn't. Where in Billy's opponents, perhaps, where, you, where would you fit Chris Eubank Jr.? Before all this, uh, where would I fit him? Well, he's way behind uh, John Ryder. Um, the other middleweight, who someone mentioned down there, um, I can't think of his name. There's a couple of fighters. Who's, uh, Spike yeah. O'Sullivan. There's a couple of fighters that I, I, you know, I did at the time book in front of him. Who was, if they was going to get a fight, but then again, it's Chris Eubanks' uh, senior son. He's, you know, he's worked it, worked it round where everyone's took to the fight, and it's a sellout. So it's about business. And, I mean, uh, Chris Eubank, uh, Junior's trainer, Ronnie Davis. Um, have you come up against uh, Ronnie Davis before, any of his fighters, and how, how has that gone? Well, he just said the day that Ronnie Davis ain't his trainer. See, all he does is put a bit of Vaseline on, which I thought was very undermining for Ron. But, yes, I've been up against Chris uh, Eubank, uh, Senior. Did you say Senior? Yeah, Junior's... Uh, like, Ronnie Davis. Against Ronnie Davis in the past. Ronnie, yeah, five times. And only, I've only had one draw, and that was against Chris Eubank Sr. I had five fighters against him. Uh, Michael Watson, the night he got injured, it was a great fight. Uh, Nigel Benn, when he drew, uh, which we, I thought we won, but we got a draw, so I'm not moaning about that. Uh, but I booked uh, Chris Eubank Sr. as a very good fighter. And do you see any similarities between um, Sr. and Junior? Any traits there that are similar? Well, not really. There could be there, but not really, because everyone he's fighting, he's, he's stopping them in one or two rounds, where Chris used to go the distance now and then. Yeah. So we haven't seen him go 12 rounds, you know, oh, 12 rounds, but we, we haven't seen this with his kids yet. So I can't say if he's as good as his dad. I might see a similarity now and then, because he is his dad's son. So, you know. And, I mean, Billy, of course, has been a distance before. Do, when do you think it will start to count um, those that experience of going rounds? Do you think that will play a major factor in this fight? Yes, it will play a major factor because um, Billy Joe's had about five or six 12-rounders on the trot, back-to-back. Back. Everyone that's been put in front of him, he's never moaned about it. Um, yeah, it's going to be a big factor, the experience. And uh, finally, what, what's your prediction? I mean, you're going to win. Do you think it'll go the distance or do you well, reckon uh, it could end early? Well, I don't make predictions about ending early or go the distance, but I'm always confident with a man I'll train. And I'm very confident with Billy Joe Saunders. So uh, after Saturday, Billy will still be a boxer? Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you so much, Jimmy. You're welcome. Thank you, mate.